Hi, I'm Anderson, a Cloud Support Engineer here at AWS Office in Cape Town, South Africa. Sometimes, customers ask me, how do I create a custom Windows EMI? I tell them, to create an EMI from existing instance as a best practice, we should run sysprep to remove all system-specific information, including the Computer Security Identifier, also known as SID. Let's get started. It's important to know a few things when using sysprep. Don't use sysprep to create a backup of your instance, because sysprep removes system-specific information. You might experience unintended consequences for an instance backup if you do so. It's not a best practice to use sysprep with a production instance. To be safe, first create an EMI of your instance, then launch an instance from an EMI outside any network that has access to your Active Directory preferably in a different VPC. Finally, run through the sysprep processes. For Windows Server 2008 through Windows Server 2012 R2, use EC2 config to initiate the sysprep. As you can see, I'm already logged into AWS Management Console. Navigate to the EC2 dashboard, then on the left, I will go ahead and choose Instance. Choose my instance, check the IP address of the source instance that we will use to create the EMI. Connect it to your EC2 instance using Remote Desktop Protocol, RDP. After connecting, from the Windows Start menu, open EC2 Config Service Settings. Go to Image tab. For Administrator Password, choose Randall. Choose Shut Down with Sysprep. Choose Yes for the confirmation prompt. Wait for the instance to move to a stopped state. Now we are ready to create an Amazon machine image. Select your instance. Choose Actions on the top. Choose Image. Create Image. For Image Name, enter a name. For Image Description, enter a description. Click Create Image. Click Close. Go to EMI's tab on the left to check the status of your image creation. After the image completes, you can start the instance you previously stopped. Go back to EC2 dashboard and wait until the instance is running. Select the instance, click Actions, Instance State, Start. Click Yes Start and wait until the instance is running. Now we have a sysprep image which can be used to launch new instances. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.